Hi, this is Peter from PowerDirectorTutorials.com. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can add a scrolling news sticker to your videos, which is uh, basically scrolling text that runs along the bottom of your videos. You probably know what I'm talking about, which you will very shortly since I'm going to show you an example here. So this is what I'm going to show you how you can do. So we can have text scrolling along here. We can change the speed. The text can be as long as you want. We can have a background. So it's customizable. Let's just jump to the end here and you can see how it ends. So I've got it fading out like that and you can just have it disappear immediately. You can do whatever you want really. Anyway, let's uh, dive into Power Director now. So I'll show you how you can do that. Just get a video prepared. So I've got some kind of unboxing video here. Let's just add that to the video track on the timeline. What we want to do now is add a title. Let's go to the title room. Select the default one, add that to the title track in the timeline. Just stretch out the length a bit. All right, so now we edit our text. Double click on the text object here. And just proceed to uh, change the color first. Have it how you want the text. So I'm going to show you um, just a standard, uh, a typical white text on a transparent black background. So I'm going to have white text. Let's go with uh, Verdana. All right, let's make it bold. And that's probably a bit too big for my liking. Let's make it a little smaller. So editing. All right, so there we go. What we do now is just move it down to the bottom here. It should automatically snap to the edges by default. And then we can just uh, enter what we want for the text. So here we go. You can pad out uh, your text using the spacebar. You can have it as long as you want. Okay, so there we have it. Just click anywhere else to end that. So here's our scroll and use ticker now. Since I've got white text, it's going to be a bit hard to see. So let's add in a background. I've prepared a background earlier. So let's just insert my background image, scroll in BG. Now it's just a very long vertical block of uh, black, which I've created in a paint program. So we add that in. Let's just resize it here. It doesn't have to be exact uh, matching the side, the uh, screen exactly. So just put it down here and uh, we set it to the background, move it down. So we have it, we can nudge it down using the cursor keys. All right, so that's good. Next step is to make it transparent. So we head over to the font face settings and reduce the transparency. Turn off the shadow effects. All right, so there we go. What you want to do next is adjust the the uh, animation properties keyframe so just adjust this 
keyframe here, just put them right towards the edges here. So that's when the animation, this uh, background will come, will appear. So you want it appearing right at the beginning and you want it disappearing right at the end. So it will fade in and fade out at the end. Let's move it a little bit more. Okay, so there we've got it. And that's it really. Let's take a look and see what it looks like. Oh, we've got to add the actual scrolling animation effect. So double click back on the text, click on the text. And now we add the starting effect. So we choose um, horizontal animation, uh, horizontal should be under roll. Scroll left. Okay, scroll left. So we choose that. Okay, so that's it. We click OK and go to movie, press play. So there we have it. There's our scrolling new sticker with the text scrolling along the bottom there. If you want to make it faster, you just reduce the length of your title object and it should move a bit faster. It also depends on how much text you have in your uh, title object. So that's about a good speed. So that's how you do it really. That's how you add a scroll and use ticker to your videos. Looks pretty good. Very simple.